Hello viewers, this video is the continuation of our docker tutorial series. If you haven't watched previous videos, then I would suggest you to watch them first. As those sessions contains basic uh, what is docker and some basics of docker and some basic commands of docker. So I would suggest you to get familiar with that first. In this session, we will deploy a static website as container. So let's get started. First of all, you need to have your Docker daemon running. So uh, I have used Docker for Mac. So my Docker is running. Okay. So we will create a, a static website, a simple index.html file, which which will be displaying a message "Hello container," and then we will use nginx as a web server, and we will uh, build the image and we'll deploy the container. So let's get started. This is our index.html. Now, now we will create a Docker file. We are, uh, we are using the base image of Nginx Alpine. So this is the smallest image. And uh, next phase we will be copying the data. We will copying index.html in the container inside the directory usr share nginx html so this is the directory uh, from where the static files uh, are being served through nginx so we are saying that in the current directory whatever files are there copy this to html directory so right now here there is only one file index.html so that will get copied inside html so that is it in our docker file now we will build the docker image so static app is the image name and uh, this is a tag v1 you can give it any tag or any name okay so image has been successfully built as uh, I have already uh, have the downloaded image of nginx alpine so it has directly used it but if you don't have it then it will pull it up and it will download it and in the second step it is copying the index.html inside nginx html directory so if we do a docker images I have a lot of images so let's do nginx image okay so this is our nginx alpine image which is of 54 mb and uh, oops So it's docker images not docker image so here is our static app image now we can run it so let's go ahead it and run it uh, let's give the container a name say web okay let's give it static app on the static app or let's give it like uh, app container and let's run it on port 80 80 so this is the host port and this is the container port so i would suggest you to go through the previous tutorials as you will un uh, easily understand uh, what are the parameters and option in this command and uh, 
our image name was static app colon v1 that is it okay so our image has been um, the container is running with this id if we do our docker ps so this is our container up and running and the container name is app container so let's go ahead and run the local host array so we have hello container static page up and running and if you want to see the logs then you can do docker logs in the image name app container so here is the log and uh, if we stop the container now if we go and check it it won't run okay so let's go ahead and run it again okay okay so uh, the app container is already there so either we need to rename it or we need to change it so anyways uh, this is all about this tutorial so uh, you can deploy your static website with docker you can create and run a container you can use any web server i have used nginx so this is all about this tutorial and if you want to go through what is docker and uh, how it's basic then you can follow my blog apichip and uh, you can watch the previous tutorials as well introduction to docker and you can see what is virtualization containerization what is an image and what is a container so all the stuff you will uh, get here itself and uh, these are easy to understand so this is all for this tutorial thanks for watching